Hi, welcome or welcome back. My name is Shira. Today I want to be talking about how to let go of expectations. So I think that it's so easy to want to control how things end up being or to look to the future and worry about how it's going to end up for us because we need to control our lives. We need to make sure that we're okay. We need to make sure that our egos are feeling nice and comfy. But all of these expectations or worries about the future and how we need to act right now to make sure everything's okay, it's not grounded in reality. It's all grounded in our heads. It's all grounded in an illusion because we think that things are going to end up how they used to be or we project the past onto our future. Now, it doesn't necessarily have to be that way. If we think the past is going to be in our future, then we act in a certain way that kind of makes sure that it is. We act impulsively and out of fear and out of need to control. But if we know that the universe has our back, we can trust our intuition and act from a place of knowing that we're okay. Letting go of the future is letting go of the past and is trusting the present moment. And is trusting that you know in your intuition, in your heart, what to do. And if it feels like we're acting from a place of fear or anger or sadness, those feelings that we act upon aren't gonna be in our best interest. We don't necessarily know what's in our best interest, but we can allow what is in our best interest to unfold for us. Now that is real letting go because things won't be how you think they will be. But in trusting ourselves and trusting the universe, they will be even better than you ever thought they could be because there is only love for you. The fear that we act upon, that we are so enveloped in has nothing to do with who you actually are. That is just the illusion that you are alone and that you are afraid and that nothing's gonna go well for you. And that's a lie. You are a manifestation of the universe. You are consciousness, you are beautiful, you are bright. All that is well in the world is rightfully yours. Anything that can hold you back from any good feeling thoughts is just an idea that we've shared with each other that is false. It is false information that you aren't fully powerful because you are fully powerful. Now this may not even resonate or may not make sense because I think that we're so conditioned to thinking that we're powerless. We're so conditioned to thinking that if we don't have a certain thing in our life, we're not lovable, we're not happy. It is not about what we think we should have. It's actually that we have everything we need within us. We have the love of the universe, the love of ourselves, the love of each other, even though it may not seem like it, there is love here for you. And that is everything. And everything comes from that. Everything else is only temporary. It is not really here for you as much as you, yourself, your connection to everything is here for you. We are connected. I'm here for you. And these ways that we try to be so that people love us, so that we love us, so that we can feel good about ourselves, it is only distracting us from who we really are. We really are complete and amazing and here for joy and play. And yes, there is lots of fear. I know that. But if we can connect to ourselves, we can know that there is peace here for us. We don't have to wait for peace. We simply just need to accept it. Peace is contagious. Just like fear is contagious, peace is contagious. And no matter how much fear is around, the peace is still there, deep within us. You can find it and you can rest there. You just have to call upon it. And the expectations of how things are gonna go won't matter anymore because you know that no matter where you are you will always have yourself 
We will always have each other in our hearts, no matter what is happening. There is love here for you, and nothing can really threaten that at all, because you have that. You have that power. It is your choice, and you're powerful. You are. You can do anything. It doesn't have to look exactly how you think it should look, but beauty comes from within, and it is all around us. I love you so much. <laughs> Bye.